Today, jury selection began for the trial of two suspects accused in the shooting death of 16-year-old Stanley Freeman Jr. DeAndre Davis and Rashawn Jordan are accused in this case. As a matter of fact, they are accused of shooting and killing Freeman, who had been uh, leaving school at Austin East Magnet High School in his car on the afternoon of February 12, 2021. Davis was 16 years old at the time of the shooting. Jordan was 14 at the time. WATE 6 on your side's Kristen Gallant has been in the courtroom all day as the proceedings begin and brings us the very latest. Lori, jury selection started a little after 9 a.m. this morning and just wrapped up about an hour ago. Now the jury pool has been narrowed down to 16. Court will continue tomorrow morning around 9 a.m. Again, as you just mentioned, DeAndre Davis and Rashawn Jordan are accused of shooting and killing Freeman, who had been leaving school at Austin East Magnet High School in his car on February 12th, 2021. Today, both the state and defense asked questions to potential jurors trying to determine who would be best fit to try this case. Criminal defense attorney Greg Isaacs is representing defendant DeAndre Davis, while Oha Robinette is representing Rashawn Jordan. Earlier this morning, the state presented the potential jurors with the elements of and criminal responsibilities of the case, including premeditated acts, first degree murder, aggravated child abuse, underlying felony, and direct and circumstantial evidence. Many of those potential jur jurors say they have heard about this case before, but have minimal knowledge about the circumstances. A big question both the state and defense attorneys ask these potential jurors is if they could leave that knowledge at the door and only base their decision on the evidence. Again, the jury poll has been narrowed down to 16 and court will resume tomorrow morning around 9 a.m. Guys. All right, thank you so much. And we want to let you know Davis and Jordan are also accused of shooting at Austin East student John John Mathis and an unidentified female as they drove away from the school back in January 2021, along with then 17-year-old Ahmad Gatlin. Gatlin would be tried as an adult and had faced charges, including attempted first-degree murder and possession of a firearm during the commission of a dangerous felony. We, of course, will be following all of these cases on air and online yeah. at WATE.com.